Hi guys and thanks for tuning in to my Glock Armor class. Today we are going to do the firing pin disassembly or striker pin disassembly. I'm going to show you how to take it out of the slide, take it apart, and put it back in. Some good tips uh, for those uh, if you want to do basic maintenance. Thanks a lot and uh, let's get started. Thanks for tuning in. Today we are going to take the firing pin uh, or striker assembly apart and reassemble it. So first thing you going to want to do is make sure your gun is empty. See, visually inspect it, nothing there, point it in the safe direction, pull the trigger. Then you're going to put the slide back, press down the slide release, or the slide uh, takedown. Okay, then you're going to want to go here and this part here, you want to push this forward. There's a little piece of plastic here, see that? You're going to be compressing it. So you're going to put this in here like this, press down, and then with your finger just push it. It'll pop off, hold your finger, keep going. And here you could take off your, um, take out your firing pin. Now to take this apart, the easiest way is to take this and put it in like this. Okay, see how I did that? And then what you do is you're going to press down on the springs. I'll try to do this at an angle. See how it exposes the little end caps? You can take those right off. Okay, see how I got those off? And that will release the tension on the spring. Take it off, and now you have it totally apart. Okay. And you're going to want to make sure when you put it together, this flat here, see how it has, uh, as you would like, a little, uh, uh, see that's not completely flat on height, if you can see that. There's like a little lip on it there. Well, you want the flat one. That's completely flat. See how flat that is? There's nothing. You want that edge. Uh, so what you're going to do is I'll show you. You want to put it back together. That flat edge is going to be to the top like that. So when you put that in, you want it to shine like this. This flat. There's nothing on that. So it doesn't uh, catch up on the uh, caps. You're going to take this in. Put this back in like this. Okay. You'll have uh, when you put that in, you'll kind of have it like that. See how I have it? You're going to hold it with your hand, compress this all the way down. Okay. You're going to take the caps, take this cap here, put it in there, go all the way down so the support finger is resting. See how it's holding it? Take the other cap. And you're going to put it on this side. Put it down. So that side's resting. See how I have that? You slowly release it. Okay. Now if you look here, you'll see that it's totally flat. Okay. You don't want it to be like crooked. Take that out. Make sure it works. You can push it down. Okay, you see it's fine. Put it back in. Light it up. Put it back into the firing channel. You're going to go and press. Oh, it gets You're going to press down here. Put this in there, and it'll actually it'll lock. It'll hold it. You're going to put your slide, rear slide cover. Press that down, just so it comes up a little. Then you're going to press on the extractor spring. Okay. Then you're going to want to make sure it's all good. You can move this back and forth. Make sure this doesn't move without pressing the plunger in. Okay. You don't have it out that way. You got to push it in that way. Okay. Then you can reassemble it. Make sure everything's tight. Inspect everything. Reassemble. Okay, like that. Fires, shake it. You hear that noise? It'll be your firing pin in there going back and forth. Also, check your recoil. Make sure it goes forward, it doesn't stay back. And you're all good. Thanks a lot. And that's uh, taking apart and reassembling the firing pin or striker.